everyone, welcome to another Cookie Run Kingdom episode. In this episode, we're going to discuss the top 10 cookies in PvP. So you heard it right from me, top 10 cookies in which you won't hesitate in leveling up and spending resources on. But before that, if you want updated Cookie Run Kingdom videos, hit it, please hit the subscribe button. It's going to be down below. Hey guys, before we start off this video, a little bit of a disclaimer. So the top 10 is actually not a ranking. It's actually a collection of the top 10 cookies. Okay, so any any one of them is actually very good right now in PvP. All you have to do is mix and match who you're going to build your team. Okay, and also this is actually a mix, a good mix already of front, mid and back cookies. So I'm sure you actually, most of you actually have, you know, some of them and some of you actually have all of them actually for me i don't have um, i think one basically you just have to choose and mix and match from these top 10 cookies okay so for pomegranate cookie she is actually primarily a healer so again and she actually also increases attack for seven seconds that's actually good about her so she's a mix of heal and also increase attack so this is very good because in pvp you actually would you know just get any increase in attack is very useful and any healing is very useful as well so she's not i think at par with uh, with her booty in terms of healing but again she gives you a different you know a different side of pvp wherein you could enhance the attack of all your cookies Okay, for the next one, we have Vampire Cookie. So he basically turns into a bat and attacks the furthest enemy. So more or less, what is good about him, which I noticed in PvP, is that he takes out the pesky healers in the back. This is actually what he brings to your team. Um, I have been a, big, uh, a victim of this already in the past, in my past PvP battles. So he takes out your pomegranate your herb cookie at the back and all of the back cookies are basically prone to his attacks okay our next cookie would be licorice cookie so summons black lightning and licorice servants that is actually his actually his bread and butter but he also briefly increases the party's defense so again three skills that give that he gives to your party um, deals deals very good damage and also the 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 what do you call this his minions or his servants are actually pretty much annoying in terms of helping your front line defend those cookie on the front especially he is actually useful in terms of his minions because if you're opposing you know if the opponent actually has only one cookie they would crowd him and they would you know attack him and he is actually either good on the attack or good on the defensive side but again his increase in defense is actually very good to support your team especially in pvp we have tiger lily cookie so charges forward at the back of the butter tiger causing damage to nearby enemies and stunning them so this is what she gives to the party basically um stuns your enemy especially if they are bunched up and she could actually stun most of them so the tiger also inflicts several close range serial damage with its claws so again she is actually valued more for her stun than anything else um and she also gives a 25 percent attack speed for 10 seconds which makes her very good in pvp next on our list would be rai cookie she actually is a bounty hunter so basically what she do she does is actually snipe out your opposing heroes so basically what she does is the cookie aims both pistols at the enemy with the lowest max hp so what do you usually have as the lowest h max hp usually again they're in the mid or in the back part of the opposing team so there's a good chance that they sh that she will also kill off the healers at the back of the opposing team that is why people are bringing her her burst her burst damage for her skill is actually very good cookie at the also a, a she increases 
she increases attack speed is increased greatly for the whole showdown duration okay so damage dealt very good and a 50 percent attack speed for seven seconds very good single target damage dealer okay our next uh, cookie would be milk cookie so milk cookie is actually a hell of a tank okay so he has taunt forcing them to attack himself while the skill is active milk cookies divine milk shield decreases incoming damage this is actually pretty much annoying especially if you want to you know if you want to deal damage to the mid or the back section of your team of the opposing team so again he is very good in terms of taunt deals damage and minus 50 percent damage for five seconds as well he absorbs a lot of damage and his staying power is very good. That is why he is good for your front line as one of your front cookies. So we have here Herb Cookie. So again, for Herb Cookie, um, very, very good in terms of healing. Um, he actually uh, also removes all the debuffs and restoring some HP to the whole party. So this is why he is very good. He actually sprouts um you know um put out sprouts and the sprouts heal your party and very good very good healing over time and again don't forget or sleep on his debuffs because this is actually very useful in the pvp as well okay our next cookie would be dark choco cookie so strikes the ground with great sword inflicting a chain lightning upon the enemies Okay, so basically, he gives them minus 20% defense for 7 seconds and damage dealt is also very big. This is actually very good. Anything that you can decrease the defense of your enemies is actually very good. That is why he is one of the best charge frontline cookies that you can have. Okay, he is one of the best right now in PvP. Very good in terms of, um, you know, in terms of dealing damage. Very good as well in holding the line um, in terms of the front line. Okay, for our next in PvP, um, she actually is a newcomer in terms of uh, cookies uh, recently added to the game. And what she does is she conjures a latte glyph attracting enemies to its center dealing damage and silencing them again i already made a video together with uh, the other cookie that i'm going to mention or are going to cover later which is express cookies okay it's it's a it's already a spoiler so i'll put a link up there so that you could try to leverage both of them es espresso and latte cookie in your pvp okay but before that espresso is actually good again because she silences your opponents preventing them from casting a spell okay before they you know go you know, before they even reach you they can't even cast a spell so basically that is how she is very good in pvp um again she is she she is one of the game changers actually for now in terms of the incoming cookies that have come in so again if you have her don't hesitate to use her even if she doesn't have stars even if she only has one or two stars please do use her she is actually very good in terms of um crowd control very good in terms of silencing and also dps okay to round out our top 10 cookies in pvp we have here a very good cookie as well espresso cookie so he actually also similar to latte cookie um drags enemies to the center she uh, he actually has um, a lot of he actually has a ver very good damage in terms of bringing them in and also uh he has interrupt skills so basically what he does is interrupt current skills that are in effect so that they go away um one example is um he can actually interrupt the skill of tiger lily um once she jumps um uh riding her tiger but before that i'll give you a bonus guys in terms of honorable mention so our honorable mention for the top 10 so basically he's the 11th cookie you can actually consider him because he is actually one of the healers um as an honorable mention we have here uh mint choco cookie which he also has healing 
and also an increase in attack speed of seven seconds okay um while for 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 pomegranate it's actually increased attack he actually gives increased attack speed for seven seconds so again it depends on you guys on how do you build your teams they're actually the core in terms of pvp you can never go wrong with any of them you can actually actually mix and match them already if you have them but if you don't not if you don't have them yet try to get them um i think you guys can already build a good pvp team um out of this 10 plus one cookies and try to mix and match them with your um current roster so that you will be able to find a good roster that works for you in pvp okay so anyway guys this is it for me for the top 10 pvp cookies or cookies in pvp again put down below comment suggestions um probably any questions on on the on this list and probably um if i missed some of the cookies on on in our top 10 pvp please put them down below anyway guys take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here